Time to work, soldiers. Well, what's up, guys? Eagle Eye Stabs here, and welcome back to another one of my videos. Uh, what you guys will be watching today is going to be a private match with a uh, bunch of enemy bots on the other team. <clears throat> And, uh, I am using the chainsaw with muzzle break and rapid fire and uh, you guys are probably wondering why I'm using that But uh, I'm actually gonna talk about that in this video And uh, just before I actually say anything else I do have the uh, bots health on minuscule which is basically like a, uh, a one-shot kill So uh, if you guys are probably wondering why I'm not people or uh, why I die really quick that's why So uh, why I wanted to make this video today is because um, we all know that it's the last couple days for Call of Duty Ghosts, and um, Advanced Warfare is coming up real soon. It gets released on uh, November 4th, or uh, if you have the Day Zero Edition, uh, it comes out on November 3rd. And uh, for those of you guys that don't know, the um, Day Zero Edition is when you get it a day early because you pre-ordered it. So um, if you don't have that, I highly recommend you get it. it uh, you have to get it, I'm pretty sure. The game for Day Zero comes out. Uh, Sunday night at uh, midnight so uh, if you do have that uh, if you don't have that go get it so uh, let me just explain to you guys why I um, decided to make this video and I'm just gonna start off with uh, me waking up so I woke up today and I was like All right, I got nothing to do so let me play some Xbox and uh, I actually didn't have Xbox Live so uh, I just bought some the other day and uh, I actually just destroyed my battle hand right there I didn't even know you could do that so it's always nice you learn something new every day but um like I was saying I uh, didn't have any Xbox Live so uh, went to GameStop last night and then I put it in today and uh, I was like alright finally I get to play because I haven't played in like maybe four or five days and that does have a um, ghost does have an effect on that so um, I put in I turned on my Xbox I started playing and I started off with Clan to Clan like I usually do and then my bullets were connecting stuff like that so I was getting pretty annoyed and uh, I just went into public match and then public match started annoying me even more because people were I was playing uh, Strike on 24-7 which is this map and people were using IEDs, IMSs, uh, rocket launchers, stuff like that to kill me I don't know how I didn't kill that guy right there by the way but uh, people were using explosives and uh, IMSs in this game are very very overpowered you could just uh you have to like look at one and then you're dead so um really overpowered apparently um infinity ward uh patched it but uh they obviously didn't do much about it because uh they're still really really annoying and a really big problem in the game so um after that i got really annoyed and uh i played maybe four or five matches and uh, I just couldn't take it anymore, so I just went into a public match to uh, get some gameplay for a commentary, uh, what you guys are watching right now. And um, I was just thinking about how I, how much I really hate ghosts. And then uh, I actually I just started randomly coming up with ideas. And then the ideas I came up with is just that the um, they have too many like patches and stuff like that, so the game gets uneven and uh, it gets really boring because of that. So um, we all know that the Vector is like the best gun in the game. And um, you could look at any uh, competitive player's classes and they're going to have the Remington and uh, Vector maybe um, like on 90% of their class. So um, that really makes the game very, very boring because it gets repetitive and uh, you know exactly how people are going to play if they're using the what guns and what perks and stuff like that. And um, my other second reason is that Infinity War hasn't really listened to their buyers because uh, we have, uh, well, not me personally, but I know that people have complained to them on uh, what's going on with the game and um, they haven't really done much about it. One of those is the uh, IMS and stuff like that. Apparently, they did patch it, but uh, they didn't really change much about it. It can still kill you very, very quickly. That guy took a really long time to die right there. But uh, it's, it could still take a long time to kill you. And um, most of you guys know that uh, either watch or play competitive uh, Call of Duty. Um, there was a bomb glitch that used to happen, and uh, that um, took them like two or three months to actually fix. And I'm not sure if it was just that it took that long to actually fix, or uh, they were like listening to people that it was actually happening. So um, that's one thing that I'm uh, actually liking about 
uh, Sledgehammer games right now because they are actually listening to the community and um, so far what we're not liking is uh, usually getting fixed by them which is uh, really really puts it, um, which, uh, makes me happy and then puts their game in a really good position because if they know that the game is uh, already better than Ghost which it most likely is because you always hear people say uh, Call of Duty Ghost is the worst game ever and uh, they're not lying about that it's really true there's just so much stuff that makes this game bad the competitive was not really thought out much you could tell it wasn't and um, just many many like bugs that disrupt the game the game's flow and stuff like that so Advanced Warfare I don't know if you guys have seen like any uh, YouTube videos on it probably not because you could probably get copyright for that but uh if you go on Twitch and then you go to Advanced Warfare, there have been people streaming it. So, um, if you guys are interested in that, just go on Twitch and you could, uh, go to games and, uh, look for Advanced Warfare. And, uh, you could probably find someone, uh, streaming that. And, uh, they also, uh, I've seen people play Exo Survival multiplayer. I haven't really seen anybody play the uh, ring playlist. This is the, uh, League play from Black Ops 2 just because uh, I don't really think anybody would be playing that so they can't really find a match. But um, that's one thing. Uh, adva Advanced Warfare is the sledgehammer is uh, listening to the actual community. So uh, whenever they have a problem, uh, they're trying to get it fixed. One of those is, uh, most of you guys know, is the dead silence. And uh, there is no dead silence. It's just like a uh, mute thing for your exosuit. And uh, that, that'll probably get changed because I don't know how that's going to work for... Uh, uh, competitive so uh, they're probably gonna end up changing that because they even said if it's not gonna fit in we're gonna change it and uh, yeah so that's really really good to hear that they're actually listening to us they're changing anything that we're not agreeing with and uh, that's how you actually that's how you um, actually um, succeed as a gaming publisher because if you if you don't listen to anybody and do your own thing then uh, you're not gonna know what the people actually want or uh, want to add into the game, and uh, yeah, so they're just not gonna like it. It's gonna get very boring really quick, and uh, you're Rock just gonna have a lot of problems with the game that you're probably not gonna know about. Um, Black Ops 2, the uh, competitive in that was actually really good. It probably set like the standard for competitive gaming in that just because um, it was uh, like the first year where competitive gaming was actually like, at its peak. And uh, in Ghost, I just feel, like I said, uh, they just didn't even think about the competitiveness of it. They uh, had a lot of problems with it at the beginning. And uh, the guns in it, they're just basically two guns that everybody uses. So it's uh, pretty boring to watch now. And uh, since it's uh, only two days away, I just can't wait just because this game is very, I'm just going to say bad. And, um, yeah, so I just hope that Advanced Warfare is, uh, already better than this. It looks like it's already better, just because, uh, of, uh, live streams and stuff like that, but we can never be sure until we play it for, like, a month. And, uh, that's the main topic I actually want to talk about. And another topic was that I, um, like I said in the earlier video, I didn't have Xbox Live, but I actually got some yesterday, and I, uh, redeemed it today. Which is, um, I guess you could say good. <laughs> it doesn't really, uh, matter to any of you guys. But, um, what I, um, saw was that a lot of you people actually wanted me to do a uh, class setup and stuff like that. So uh, I might actually, I mean, not class, um, a uh, gaming setup. A lot of you guys actually wanted to see it. So I might do a video on that. Um, maybe tomorrow, maybe, uh, earlier this week, or maybe next week. And, um, It'll be pretty fun. I don't really have that much good stuff, but um, if you guys really want to see it, can't yeah, really. Uh, I'm gonna upload it. So um, another thing I actually wanted to talk about was that um, and the fact that it hasn't. Uh, Advanced Warfare hasn't even come out yet, and they're already planning events for it. That's a very good sign for me. And um, I just completely got off topic there, but um, my mic kind of like uh, turned off, so I had to restart that. And um, this might be my last Ghost video if I uh, don't make a uh, video tomorrow 
on uh, what the um, guns are and kill streaks stuff like that on Advanced Warfare because stuff like that already leaked because like I said people have early copies of the game so they're live streaming stuff like that so um if this is my last ghost video that will be and um I won't really miss this game just because I said it in a couple times in the video I hate this game so bad and um I'm just not gonna really be able I'm not gonna play it at all once Advanced Warfare comes out and uh yeah so hope you guys enjoyed this uh, commentary if you do remember like comment subscribe follow on my social media links that will be down in the description below and uh let me know what you guys think of actually about um ghost and advanced warfare and uh like uh what you guys think about the two games and uh competitive call of duty for advanced warfare and uh please remember to like comment subscribe follow me on my social media links that will be down in the description below and i'll see you guys next time peace out